Last October, the World Rowing Championships raked in more than $23 million in economic impact for the Sunshine State. Now Nathan Benderson is looking at its next major rowing event this weekend to jumpstart what they say is a sport growing in popularity. ABC 7's Dwayne Lindo gives us a preview of what you'll see. Well, Jacqueline, it's the first time the NCAA Division I two and three women's rowing championship will be held at this venue. It will feature 22 squads, including the University of Central Florida. And you'll be surprised at the number of local kids that are competing. Crossing the finish line first. It's the type of event Sarasota Crew Varsity coach Caitlin Crouch is familiar with and passionate about as a former crew member for San Diego State University. She agrees the economic exposure for this area will be great, but the event serves a bigger purpose. You know, rowing is a growing sport and that a lot of people are interested in it and also should be looking at it for potential college opportunities. And a number of women competing got their start here with Sarasota Crew, Sarasota Scholars, and Manatee County Youth Rowing. There's people from Yale, Texas, Duke, I mean, all sorts of different places, Stanford. And it's nice to have that connection because they um, look to us for help with training facilities while they're here. Sanka is the organization that manages Nathan Benderson Park. Their CEO says it's not a coincidence that many local young women are competing. I think any time that, that we can uh, expose our community uh, to sport, and uh, positive role models, uh, I think that's always a big win. And with Benderson hosting numerous rowing events each year, preparation is already underway for upcoming projects that Rodriguez is hoping will attract thousands. We'll be hosting the, the Sunshine State Games and that'll kind of that'll kind of wrap up our regatta season here in, in the spring. For that last weekend of September, we're going to be hosting the World Rowing Masters Regatta. You get to see uh, athletes who are uh, in, in their latter years of rowing coming out and competing. For Crouch, she believes these regattas are a win-win for all involved. The more big events that Nathan Benerson Park is able to facilitate and able to handle, I think it just shows even more what the city can handle as well. Now this event is something Nathan Benderson will have in the future. They'll host the women's championships in 2021, 2020 and 2021. Reporting live in Sarasota County, Dwayne Lindo, your Suncoast News.